Show me. I weep for you. <laughs> you all should have let me have it. That sword you hold, the one you stole from the camp. We stole, these men and I. But there is only one sword, and can be only one owner. Tyr's hand is now mine. My dear friends, my brothers, my kinsmen. They coveted it, but I could not let them have it. No. I had no choice. An Ulfbert sword, made from crucible steel. I've never seen one up close. It sells for a large amount of coin. There is almost no price that can match the sword. It has both immense power and beauty. Once you wield the sword, you will understand. <laughs> Though that will not happen. If you want it, there is only one way. We must fight. Look at me. Look well. Do I look like these men? Make the wise choice and give me the sword. I am looking. I am seeing. Uh, I... No. I killed my brothers. I must have it. Else it will all be for naught. They're gone. And you deserve no respite for betraying your kin. Leave the blade. Walk away. And never appear before me again. His men. His brothers. His kinsmen. His sword. A fine way. I should probably not let Toka see us. Me, only me.
cautious around here. Go, Sunan. You seem to be waiting for someone. Everyone is waiting. For resolve, for courage, for love. For heirs to be delivered under the cover of night. I have the supplies you're waiting for. Ah, finally, the medicine. The children have been waiting for days. Day and night I have prayed all I can. But their fevers do not subside. And the war's over, quickly! Coin first, and throw in a bit more for my trouble. What? Outrageous! This... these are mine! I will only pay you the coin owed, not any more! Do you want them or not? Fine. Here, that is more than a fair price. What happened to the lad who used to bring these here? Replace him. Goodbye.
best not to draw attention here. Aid me, be my eyes. So we have no friends who's trash. Toka said King Charles carouses at this tavern. Strange to drink and make merry on the eve of war. The fat king. What other king could I mean? They say he sleeps here. He slept here, he ate here, he drank here, and he left here. Where he went after that? Who am I to say? No luck finding the king. Eivor! No, no luck. Finding such a large, famous man should be easy, but not for me. Come, let us drink. Who are these strange folk? Fools with no shame and no honor. Players who perform for the king. One of these fools may lead us to that greater fool. The king. <laughs> Don't bother. It's like talking to drunks or goats. Or drunken goats. Eivor, I, I should thank you. <clears throat> for what? For backing me against Siegfried. He will not talk to the Franks, but we should still try, yes? Yes. And you can do this thing, with or without him. But I failed. Nobody here will tell me where to find the king. What should I do? A wise shield warrior must know both swords and words. Watch and learn. <laughs> Greetings, good sir. I would offer my sword to your king. Where may I find him? When the great bear was sleeping, the jesters went creeping into the great bear's room. The jesters were all drinking, dancing and singing, even if waking the bear spells doom. The bear might be the king, so the king had a room. You there, acting strange. Where is your king? As mute as the dead. No matter. found what I need. Charles enjoys the theater and I'm young. Good. Let us go. No. He may lash out if he meets one of Siegfried's clan. Best I go alone. As you wish. But meet me here when you are done and tell me what he said.
What do you see? by Lucifer, but mortal all the same. Charles, I heard two voices. Who else is back here? No one but me and this weak creature of flesh. <coughs> Forgive me. Talking to that which does not exist opens the door for something that does. This I know. Let me assure you, my demon exists, as does my god. <coughs> Kill me. Make me a martyr king. I should slay you where you stand. For that trick you played on me and the Queen. <laughs> that will not get you what you want, huh? Peace and a, a free hand in England, correct? Only you can save your people from Siegfried's wrath. If the world were so simple, bread would grow on trees. Odo is a great man with greater ambitions. All of my nobles make demands of me. So does the Pope, and the Greeks, the Slavs, the Saxons, the Saracens. And you, huh? Haha, <laughs> you Northmen. You demand land, and hostages, tribute. Sometimes the best move is not to move at all. You would let your enemies slaughter one another. I will let my enemies paint God's green earth red with infidel blood. While pious Charles prays only for peace. Is there nothing you want? Yes. By now you know I care not a whit for my barren wasteland of a wife. But your son, Bernard. My only heir. Bring me the prince, unharmed, and I will consider the merits of your offer. Else be gone. You want him brought to a dingy theater where you talk to yourself in the dark? Hmm. No. Present my son to me on the field of battle, before all my men and vassals. Why then? Why wait? My nobles need to see me getting something from you, northerners. Now, until that day dawns, there is the door. Bye. 
Attack of the Dalkin <laughs> Theater! <laughs> on site here. You look none the worse for ale. How much did you drink? Not enough to make me enjoy those awful Frankish scalds. But tell me, will Charles sign a truce? He will not even speak to us until we hand over his son Bernard. But we do not have the bastard boy. No, but I know where the Queen took him. The Plague Ward, south of the city. I will gather my thanes and take them hostage. To seize the Prince lacks honor. But we should keep an eye on the boy all the same. Hmm. I know a man of keen eye and light step. Pierre. A wise choice. So, one step closer to breaching the walls and burning a city. Yes. And I do not want this thing. But what else can we do? See you back at the camp, Toga. Trail of blood. Secret passed this way.
bloody path through this tower. Workshop. The perfect place for our catapults. An army of wooden giants to bring down the walls. Those Franks. What are they doing? Ah, they slay another of their own today. For what? Who can say? If a man prays to the wrong god, sleeps with the wrong woman, follows the wrong king, by Frankish law. That man dies. Among the Saxons, it is much the same. Aye, but the Saxons are fewer. They are divided, and they fight both us and the Celts. These Franks, though, united under a great king. It would be like unleashing Fenrir the wolf upon the world. We are God's priests, and we are good. But if thou do that which is evil, fear! For we beareth not the sword in vain. Who are those two? I've seen that warrior priest with Count Odo before. Goslin and Ebos. Warriors and brothers. One leads the priests of Paris, the other the Frankish armies. For we are God's priests. Avengers to execute wrath upon him that doeth evil. Wherefore ye must- Brother, you talk too much! Come on. Let us go take that workshop now. Quite a show they put on. We'll have to fight those Franks soon. True, but today is not that day. <clears throat> My men are ready. Come, let's take some ground for the catapults. I would never give my warriors a shameful death like that. Nor would I. <laughs> but I have met rotten rulers in many lands. You speak true, Siegfried. The Franks have no monopoly on wickedness. Almost there. Now, for light and stick to the rooftops. and make it our own! We scouted the place. They keep watch, but not well. And the sight lines? A perfect place for our catapults to hurl stones upon that cursed town. I never took you for a rooftop runner, Siegfried! I am no goat-footed climber like you. But I hold my own on cliffs and walls. Attack! Vengeance or death! Our new catapults are eager for battle. Wood and stone is the sound of victory. And vengeance. This area is off limits. This is a good line of sight on the city walls for our catapults. Well done, Siegfried. Yeah.
gives me strength. Great victory. The gods smiled upon this day. Indeed. This gives us another place where our catapults can smash down their walls. Eivor, know you the fate of Vida Odinson? The god of vengeance who fights beside his father in the battle at the end of days. Yes. Vida avenges him. Vida twists the great wolf's neck with his bare hands, then stabs the beast through the belly. So say the Nornir. Days like today, I walk in the shoes of Vida, avenging my brother. Other days, there is nothing. We will bring those walls down on Odo's head, and I will avenge my brother. It is good. We shall meet back in camp when all is ready, Siegfried.
find Nolwyn. Now to find Nolwyn, the Breton smuggler Toka told us about. If there is a weakness to the island, she'll know it. Pardon, friend. Did I hear you speak of a smuggler named Nolwyn? I did. That damn thief promised a jug of wine to guard her warehouse. Oh. And where is her warehouse? It's, uh, over to the east somewhere. Got a play cross painted on it. Thank you, my friend. Perhaps you should sleep it off before going back on guard duty. All right. Good idea. My eyes soon in. Stretch your wings, Sunan. What see you, old friend? the peace of our church. Who can trust the pagan diable? How many have you killed, fiend? Franz, remember. When the good Samaritan saw the beaten man, he had compassion and bound his wounds. You keep busy, queen. Someone must tend to those who fall in battle. Plague did this, not war. War breeds plague, Eivor. I am not yet ready to return to Charles, if that is what brings you here. No. I seek a Breton who resides in this ward, name of Nolwyn. I know her! A freelance thief! A disreputable woman, although not without talents to those who can pay. They say she can smuggle goods and messages over walls and past guards. Yes. So why do you seek this woman's help? I have 
have urged the truce on all sides without success. But I can still try. But Siegfried the Frankular leads this army, not you. He inflicts his vengeance upon us, town by town. Because the Franks killed his brother. How many Northmen must die so Siegfried can avenge one man? Should his knees die too? Should you? I cannot stop entire armies. Only urge reason and a truce on all sides. I do what I can. You did save my life. I must take that first step and trust you, my good Samaritan. Thank you, Queen. I am in your debt. I mean that. So, where is this Breton? Alas, I do not know. She visits from time to time. I know! I know the way to Norin's hideout. Please, let me show Eivor! From the mouths of babes. Very well, but hurry back, little bear. Not so fast, little prince. This place is not safe. Nowhere in France here is safe now. Mother Richardie says so. How is it you know where this smuggler works? Yesterday I went on an adventure and followed her. But she saw me and waved. I felt silly. Ah, I've been down this way before. Thank you, Bernard. Get back to the Queen. Bye, Eivor. Have fun, and let's have another adventure <gasps> soon. have any silver. Mm. I am not here to take your silver. I have no quarrel with you. Praise the saints. And I thank you for your fine and timely blade. But I must go. No. You see, I'm a friend of Richardis, Queen of Francia. And I am married to the Pope. Long may he reign. They say you walk through city walls. I need your help. I am no ghost. Just a simple bout from Brittany that has lost her way. Look, you are a smuggler. All Paris knows it, even the boy prince does. I need your help. And if I know a thing or two about all that, what is it worth to you? My friend Toka wants a necklace back. This I know. There is her chain, friend. Tell her to find me a knot when this is all over. Toka shall hear your words. All is well. So what do you need, Northerner? I seek a weakness in these walls. Is there a hidden tunnel, a secret door, or something like that? No, no, not so simple. The Franks sealed the city well. But take this key. It will open the bridge door. The bridge? I can reach the bridge from outside. What I could use is a way to take it down. A little silver birdie told me that the bridge's foundations are in dire shape. I see. And if we can take the bridge down, the longships can encircle the city. You did not hear this from me. Farewell. Where is this bridge? It must be near.
was right. Some jars of grease will bring this bridge crashing down. I'll set up the jars so we can destroy the bridge later during the attack. Hey, you don't belong down here. Though, to be honest, neither do I. Then let us pretend we're both elsewhere. Eh, uh, why not? We are all doomed. Tell me to scout the army by myself. What do I want with their suicide mission? Let's see how well they hold the city without their precious bridge, bastards. Maybe if I moved something I could get across. <laughs> Lord Jesus, Lord is set for the siege of the island. Better return to the others.
I need your eyes, my friend. Guards here, vigilant.
Don't forget! Magnifique! If you want to do more, I'll be here. I'm surprised to see that cat still here. It will not leave, and it takes up space. It does not help that Dero and Enna find amusement in how attached it is to me. Your little band of rebels is growing. Funny. But truthfully, they grow stronger with each victory, as does their confidence. They are bolstered by our victories, and it's easier to convince new recruits to join. Soon this hideout will not hold them all. We will face that when the time comes. For now, we fight. So, what will it be? What can we do for the rebels? All for now, what do you want to do? How do the that's all for now? How can I help? What have you got? Can I help you? What have you got for me today?
have to go. Always a pleasure. Cast about this land, my friend. I must be on Dogging. My eyes. 